Good morning, you guys. My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my Christ subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. It's free general collective reading for all signs. Caps and besides everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash at Movenmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. If you choose to donate, love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Okay, so I received a channeling to speed daily tea today. Um, love you guys. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, I heard a Libra that, um, that help. I heard a lawyer in a masculine energy, so... I don't know if the lawyer is a masculine energy or it's two separate energies, like a lawyer and a masculine energy. I just heard a lawyer and, and masculine energy. So to me, it could go two ways. It could be a lawyer that is a masculine energy or a lawyer and a masculine energy. But you plug it in how it resonates in your own particular life and situation. But it is a Libra and energy. Masculine or femme Libra, they could have Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, Walt, Dome, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. But whoever this Libra is, they help either a masculine energy lawyer or a lawyer and a masculine energy steal a femme energy's money. And I heard it was a large amount of money. Um, but I heard through many series of chain events, uh, negative karma is about to boomerang back upon the uh, Libra in a very negative way. Um, I heard uh, family betrayal in a huge way. That was the first one. So it sounds like this is the way it's about to boomerang back for them in the form of negative karma. Um, some kind of huge family betrayal for them in some shape, form, or fashion, whoever this leaper is. Uh, that was the first one. And then, I'm sorry, let me, I got to remember the other one. There was another one too. Oh yeah, hacking, hacking, yeah. So, ha um, some kind of huge family betrayal in some shape, form, or fashion. This is the negative karma the sleeper is about to receive in the universe because of their bad decision as far as stealing a feminine energy's money and knowing about it and helping steal the fem energy's money to either a lawyer or a masculine energy or a masculine energy lawyer. Um, family betrayals and hacking. So some kind of hacking and family betrayals. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates, you guys. Um, whoever this Libra is, it can be masculine or femme Libra. But they're going to have some hacking. Uh, apparently, it sounds like somebody's about to hack them. And there's about to be some kind of um, family betrayal in some shape, form, or fashion. So you plug it in, how it resonates, you guys. Holy freaking A. We'll pull a couple cards and then we'll close it, okay? Also, this person is about to start getting stalked, very heavily stalked. They stalked this feminine energy in the past for a long time, obsessed. Now, they're about to start getting stalked. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's lovely. Okay. So, there's going to be some hacking going on. There's going to be some uh, family betray major family betrayals. Now, major family betrayals. So, I'm thinking maybe... Maybe it's at a family reunion and there's some big-ass fight that breaks out or somebody gets physically violent or there's some kind of cheating, major cheating situation. If they're not polyamorous or polygamous or what have you, what have you, like sister wives type crap um, or what have you, what have you. But there's some kind of major family betrayal, whatever the hell it is and how that applies. And I heard they're about to start getting majorly stalled, this Libra is. It can be masculine or family Libra. But I heard this Libra in the past, they majorly stalked the same thing, the energy that they helped this masculine energy or the lawyer or the masculine energy lawyer steal the money from the femme energy. They stalked her and then helped steal her money. But now they're about to start getting stalked. People are too damn whack in 2022. And that's just the truth. Too damn whack. Wake up call. Yeah, I would. I think they're about to get a huge ass wake up call. 
I mean, I would, and that's just the truth. But of course, I'm not into criminal, and I'm not into stalking folks. Um, and that's just the damn truth. But apparently, this person is. Or was. They were into stalking. But now, it's about to energetically boomerang back upon them in the form of them. They're asking to stalk. And they helped somebody steal somebody's money. And they stalked them? Like, that's not correct. I mean, that's truly not correct. And I'm just being for real, for real. That is seriously not correct. Wake up call. This Libra is about to start going through so much stuff, so many things at one time, soon, that they probably will end up having a mental breakdown. Once they have the mental breakdown, they will probably enter into a mental institution. Okay, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So, um, holy good God. So, I'm assuming that's the grounding. They're going to get grounded in the form of a mental institution. Um, whether they free willingly put themselves there or they do it or they have some kind of breakdown out in public and the police get called and then the police um, get involved and probably transport them to a, a mental institution within policies and procedures, I'm presuming. Um, but you plug it in, how it resonates. Um, I didn't hear that was going to be the case with the police and all that, but I, I've heard stories of that. Like, people out in public, they have, like, mental breakdowns, or they just go completely freaking bananas out in public. Um, like, start harming themselves or others out in public, and, um, and then the police end up getting involved, and then they're able to transport them for mental health treatment, emergency mental health treatment, at a mental health institution because they're, they're endangering, endangering public safety and themselves um whoever these people are um i mean I, i've heard stories of that is what i'm saying so that's what i think could be one situation there if it is in public i didn't hear if it was in public or not whoever this is this libra but um uh i heard they will have a breakdown it sounds like they're gonna have one soon but it's because they're about to go through all the shit but what and i don't know if they think about this or not but they put a feminine energy through all kinds of shit in the past. They stalked her, like stalked, stalked, stalked her. And they helped steal her money and gave it to either a masculine energy, a lawyer, or a masculine lawyer. Like, what? And the thing is, is lawyers make good money or they should make good money. And that's just the truth. So what? I wonder what kind of profession she is if she needed the money. Or... It doesn't even matter if she needed the money or not. You should never steal from anybody. But the thing is, you give it to a damn lawyer? Like, what? I mean, what? That doesn't even make no damn sense either. And that's just the damn truth. You shouldn't steal from anybody. Much less give it to somebody that probably don't need it, i.e. a lawyer, if anybody needs to hear that. Anyways, I heard they're uh, probably going to have a mental breakdown soon, so I don't know if it's going to be publicly, like the whole Britney Spears thing 50 million years ago, where her dad ended up using that shit so public, and her ex-lover, Kevin Finderline, and they used it against her and ended up abusing the hell out of her for about 10 or 15 years. Um, so I don't know if it's going to be something like that, or something else, but um, it's I heard she will end up in a mental institution through many series of chain events after that. So I don't know if she's going to free willingly put herself there to ground herself or if it's going to be like so public, like a Britney Spears type thing. And maybe the police get involved or somebody else get involved or what have you, what have you. Okay. But there's definitely going to be a wake up call there. Holy good Lord. We're all about this Libra energy in here. Masculine fin Libra. Okay. This Libra does not want certain information out, but it's already out, and it's about to go, about to be way more out.
They're about to be mortified, but they've done this to themselves. Okay. Dear God. So I heard this Libra, Massacre Kim Libra, they don't want certain information out, but I heard it's going to get out whether they want it out or not. And basically, um, uh, it's going to get out whether they want it out or not. Tough Titty said the kitty. I mean, and if you don't like it, that triggers you. You can click off. Just saying, just saying. But that's just the truth. Um, and um, uh, certain information is going to get out. It's going to get out whether they want it to get out or not. And that's just the damn truth. And um, so it sounds like it's going to mortify them. It's going to mortify them. It's going to piss them off. It's going to mortify them. And I think that's what's going to cause the mental breakdown. So wake up call. Gonna be, uh, need to ground themselves. Their instinct was to be a terrible person in the past. They uh, lurked and stalked and stole from a feminine energy. They never were a positive influence in this person's life. I mean, hell, you stalked somebody, you lurked somebody, and you steal from their ass. I wouldn't want to be around that person every day in my life. And I hope nobody else would want to be around that kind of person. They not only stalk this person, this fame energy, it could be you they've stalked, lurked, and stole from. You plug it in how it resonates. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. Not only did they stalk, for, uh, stalk them, they lurked them. Stalking and lurking, same thing. Creeping on them. Sneakily, behind the scenes. Freaky, 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 weird. And they help steal from them. Like, how much worse of a person can you be? And that's just the damn truth. I mean... I don't care what sign this person is. I just heard they're a Libra. They can have Libra in any aspects of their chart. I don't care what sign this person is. It's just this person in general is a terrible ass person. And that's just the truth. They need to really, they need a full blown mental assessment is what they need. And that's just the damn truth. Because their instincts were all I, uh, being a good person. They would never get the five star good person award in kindergarten, in my opinion. Of course, this person is a grown-ass adult, and they know not to make these kind of decisions, but yet they made, chose to make them anyways. And the scary part is, they were able to get away with it. They have people in their own universe that actually allowed them to do it. There should have been somebody that stood up to them and said, no, we're not going to do this. That's not right. But yet, it didn't happen. Some bullshit, if you ask me. A Taurus is about to be down this Libra's throat in a huge way. Because this Taurus is about to get a lot of flack. A lot of flack. And an Aquarius is about to be under investigation. Financial investigation. Business investigation. It, it is about to piss them off in a huge way. A huge way. Oh my God. Okay. So I'm assuming this Taurus and this uh, Aquarius are connected to this Libra. Because we're all about this Libra in here. And this lawyer that apparently was happy to steal from this damn energy. Uh, if it is the masculine lawyer. I heard a masculine and a lawyer. So I'm assuming it's a masculine lawyer that free, free willingly was happy to steal all this money from this fame energy. What? Be a better person, masculine lawyer or masculine and lawyer, if that resonates for you. That, I mean, hell, you're a damn lawyer. You're supposed to follow the law, not break the law, if anybody needs to hear that. Okay? Just saying, just saying. Um, I heard a... Um, Taurus is about to be down. At, it could be masculine and Taurus. They can have Taurus in any aspects of their chart. But I heard they're about to be down this Libra's throat. I don't think physically down their throat. I think like calling, connecting, contacting, maybe physically around them. 
but they're really about to be like breathing down their neck, like in a, not a physical way, but like a communicative, communicative way is what I feel, um, to this Libra. Um, I heard because it's something of the past, um, and it doesn't sound like they're going to let it go because it said, uh, I heard the Taurus is about to be under heavy fire. So Taurus is getting a huge wake up call. They want to ground themselves, but somehow they have been connected with this Libra in the past. Um, and something's coming around for this Taurus. So it's about to cause the Taurus to connect with this Libra in a negative sense, because it sounds like they were connected with some in the past, but now it's about to come around on Taurus and, and the Libras get, uh, it sounds like Taurus got taken out of Libra. Whoever the Taurus is, Master and Taurus. You could be this Taurus. You plug it in how it resonates. But Taurus is getting a huge wake-up call, or they're about to. They want to ground themselves. But they're about to take it out on Libra. If this Libra sounds like a damn bad news bear. And I'm just being for real. It sounds like they're a bad egg. It sounds like all these people connected to this Libra. But in all fairness, though, these other people sound like bad eggs, too. They should have made the free willing decisions to make bad decisions with Libra. If any of those people need to hear that, I'm just being for real. But anyways, the Taurus is about to breathe down the Libra's throat, blame it on the Libra, blase, 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 because the Taurus is getting flat. Well, Taurus, you shouldn't have made bad decisions to begin with, if you need to hear that. Just saying, just saying. And then we've got a, um, um, who was the other one? An Aquarius. An Aquarius. I heard their business is about to start um, being investigated. Um, and I heard they're about to be pissed. Um, whoever this Aquarius is. I heard their bank accounts and their business. And I heard it's about to start. And it's not going to go well for them at all. At all. They will probably end up in prison. Through many series of chain of events. Oh my God, what the holy hell? Oh my God. And I heard the Aquarius will, uh, it, it won't go well for them. It will not go well for the Aquarius. I heard they will probably end up in prison through many series of chain of events. Um, there's something illegal or behind the scenes or not right with this business or this bank account or bank accounts or something with the money department and the business sector. Uh, oh my God. I heard they're about to start getting investigated. So I think it might be a Fed investigation or a state investigation or Better Business Bureau investigation or something. Somehow they're about to be investigated. It's something to do with their business and bank accounts. So I'm thinking it might be a Fed investigation or, um, or police investigation or PI or maybe it's a Fed investigation or better be business bureau or something it's something but how that resonates um it's not gonna go well for them and i heard basically um they will probably end up in prison through many series of shame events so they're about to get a huge wake-up call and i heard they're about to be pissed at the libra both of these are about to be pissed taurus and the aquarius are about to be pissed at the libra we have instinct under that their instinct is going to be pissed at this libra but the thing is these all these people sound like crooks and criminals they sound like they they want to place the blame on somebody else. Oh, they're pissy. There are all these bad, negative things that are going to start happening to them. They want to blame it on this Libra. Why are they blaming on the sales for the things they've done na nasty and bad in the universe? And that's just the truth. There's something not correct going on with this business here. I'll tell you that right now. There's something not going correct going on with business or the bank account or bank accounts and money. Um, this might, this Aquarius might be the one, might be the masculine or the lawyer or the masculine lawyer that helped steal the money from the feminine energy in cahoots with the Libra, possibly. But I will tell you there's something not correct going on with bank account or bank accounts and money. I'll tell you that right freaking now. Their instincts is going to want to blame this Libra. But the thing is, is they made their own bad choices. So I, you know, whatever, man. This is some crazy crap. They're about to get wake-up calls. They're going to need to brown themselves. First, in my opinion, the first thing is they need to take accountability for their own actions. And that's just the damn truth. An Aries is about to ever regret they got involved with this. Ever regret it. 
And Aries is about to get phone call after 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 phone call. After phone call. Investigation. Oh my God, we have got a lot of investigation in here. Um, whoever this Aries is, I heard they're about to ever regret they got involved with this. So this Aries, I think, knows probably this Aquarius, this masculine or lawyer. It might be the Aquarius, I'm feeling, maybe for some. I feel for some, the Aquarius might be a masculine lawyer or a lawyer or masculine, possibly. But you plug it in how it resonates. Um, the Taurus or the Libra. But the Aries knows somebody in here. Either the uh, Libra, the Taurus, or the um, Aquarius, or the masculine lawyer, which I think might be the Aquarius. But you plug it in how it resonates. But how that resonates, um, an Aries is about to get their phone blew up. I heard phone call, phone call, phone call, phone call, some kind of investigation. Um, so. I feel energy is going to reverse. So I feel that uh, I heard they're about to ever regret getting involved with these people. So I wonder if the Aries is about to investigate these people. If they're about to investigate these people or they're in negative cahoots with these people. It can go both ways. Energy is going to reverse. So I feel that Aries might have known these people from childhood or the past. And now they're investigating them either for the police or feds or um, PI or what have you, what have you. or they are in negative cahoots with them, and now their ass is under investigation. You have to plug it in how it resonates, but an Aries is about to start getting phone call after phone call after phone call after phone call after phone call. I heard they're about to ever regret getting involved with this. Um, I would say so. I just cray cray. Uh, you know the bumper stickers, the hashtag stay off drugs, hashtag stay out of criminal activities. If anybody needs to hear that. On Libra's teenage daughter, there's about to be a very significant sex video regarding the Libra's teenage daughter. It's about to be spread around the community and the school. This person has gotten around, and this Libra knows this. Oh, my God. Whoa. Yikes. So, there's someone that's, okay, yikes. Uh, I I don't like tapping too much into people's, <laughs> I don't want to know about this Libra's teenage daughter and their sex video, but apparently, we all know about it now. So, you plug it in how it resonates. So, it, the, the Libra, the the this is a grown-ass adult, by the way. This is a grown-ass adult that loved to stalk and lurk. Loved to stalk and lurk a feminine energy in the past. One, that's not correct. And that's just the damn truth. Two, they help a masculine energy, a lawyer, or a masculine energy lawyer steal money from the feminine energy in the past. And that's not correct either. And this is a grown-ass person. So grown that they popped out a teenager. So they're, I mean, they are just grown, 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 grown. I mean, or supposed to be, but not really mentally grown, if that makes sense. But physically age grown. Because if you were mentally grown, you wouldn't stalk and lurk and want to steal from others. And that's just the truth. But they are old enough to have a teenage daughter, I'll tell you that. I heard the teenage daughter apparently has had sexual relations apparently around the block. So I'm thinking with many, with 
several partners, I'm presuming, maybe two or two plus partners. I heard around the block, so I think they probably have had sexual relationships with many people, is what I'm trying to say. But uh, there's some kind of sex video, apparently, this, um, and she knows she made it. And she's making money off of it, but through many series of time events, that's about to stop. She's about to get herself in a lot of trouble and the person that helped her make this money. Oh my God Almighty. Whoa. Okay, so this isn't hidden for your camera sex tape energy. This is um, not like revenge porn. So this isn't like revenge porn. She's actually making money off of it. And she recruited somebody to help her make the money off of it. But she is a minor. She's a minor. I heard she's a teenager. She's a minor. So she helps somebody. I mean, um, she got somebody to help her, um, I guess, produce the video or distribute the video or what have you, what have you. But she's a minor. She's a minor, which that's very legal. You can't have minors in sex videos, porn videos, because that is a felony, a felony, a felony, a felonious offense. You can't. Somebody's getting a huge wake up call. I'm serious. It is. It's a felonious offense. You cannot have minors in sex videos. I don't care if they want to be in them or not. And that's just the truth. Not anybody under 18, whoever this person is, I think they're under 18. They most certainly under 18. They were in high, high school. Oh my God almighty. Whoa, this is terrible. Okay, that's confirmation. They most certainly are under 18. And I heard they're in high school. But they free willingly wanted this porn video out so they can make money off of it. But they're under 18. That's a felony, felonious offense. If anybody watches the porn, like on Pornhub, read the, the little uh, FBI warnings at the very beginning. If anybody's thinking I'm crazy, read the FBI warnings at the beginning. Just saying, just saying. Heard someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Well, she, I wonder, she, her ass is going to end up in prison. It's a feminine um, teenager. It's a daughter of the adult Libra. It's a feminine teenager. And I heard um, she has free willingly made this porn video, but she has recruited somebody else to help her distribute it, produce it, what have you, what have you. But she's a teenager. She's a teenager. She's a minor. But she free, but it's not re revenge porn. Somebody did an implant a hidden camera and like exploit her. She wanted this done. But she is a minor. She's about to get some people in a lot of freaking trouble, I feel. Oh, my God almighty. Oh, this is terrible. I heard she wanted it done so she could have the money. And I heard they've made a lot of money off of it. There are many series of chain events. It's about to stop. Someone very important is about to find this out. It's about to get sent to a very important person. It's about to stop. There's about to be a huge investigation on that, too. It is not going to go well. This person is definitely a minor. Oh, my God almighty. This is so terrible. So, okay, so the video is about to get sent to somebody um, important. I'm thinking maybe a Fed or a position of authority in the community or something. Somehow the sex video is about to stop. I heard it's been spread all around the, her school. I'm assuming it's a female. Um, and the community. But she wants it spread around her community and the school so she can make money off of it. Um, she is a teenager. She's in high school. She is the, I'm assuming, the daughter of the Libra. But, um, and apparently, she, I think she's had two or two plus partners in the past, so she had confidence in this sex video. Like, she wasn't, um, I don't feel she was, um, you know, it's not like a revenge porn, illicit voyeur camera video. She wanted it made. So, and she's making revenge porn. You don't make money off of it. Somebody re does it out of revenge with the um, illicit voyeur camera to strictly get revenge on you, and you don't make a dime. This isn't revenge porn. This teenager knew, and she's been making money off of it. She wanted it done so she can make money off of it. Revenge porn, you don't make money off of it. So, I heard basically. Uh, the school, it's all around the school, it's all around the community, and somebody is about to get sent to somebody important soon, and it's about to get shut down, 
And there's about to be a huge investigation there, too. I think people are about to go to prison here. I mean, I'm, I'm serious. This isn't um, like pedophile energy or anything, but it is minor energy. Minors cannot be in porn videos. I don't care if they want to be or not. To my knowledge, they cannot be. Unless the rules have changed. Unless the rules have changed. To my knowledge, minors cannot be in uh, porn videos. And that's just the truth. Per federal law. For reasons. I don't care if they want to be or not. And this aspect is sexual instinct. But this person wants it out. They want the money. This is sick shit. Oh, God Almighty. Wake up call to the community. Because um, I heard something stop. Uh, so I think we're going to give a wake up call in the school. I'm surprised that somebody in this uh, school, a student in the school, doesn't report it to a teacher, report it to administration, report it to the police, report it to somebody. There is about to be many shocking series of chain events in this school. It is about to spread like wildfire. It's about to erupt in this school. It's about to cause huge problems. Huge problems. There's about to be chaos in this family dynamic with investigate with investigator. There's about to be serious legal issues here in the school. In the community. Oh my God. Whoa, this is terrible. This is terrible. Okay, so that makes sense. So there's chaos about to erupt in the school. Uh, it sounds like the light side students are about to actually do something about it. They're actually about to do something about it in a positive manner. And um, they're going to stand up. I mean, there's other ways of making money. I don't care if you're flipping burgers at Jack's for minimum wage or you're working at McDonald's for $15 an hour. It saves embarrassment of this. But whoever this teenager is, their brain hasn't developed enough. All they're thinking about is money, 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 apparently. All they want is the Benjamins. And apparently, they I mean, they're very experienced in sex, so they're okay with their body. But the thing is, is what they, I, I guess they don't understand, or they haven't been taught, or they didn't want to understand, is that they have to be 18 plus to do the porn videos. For law reasons. They apparently have broke the rules, and they have um, drove people around to break the rules, and it's about to backfire on them. Um, it's about to backfire in a huge way. It's about to backfire in a huge way. Yeah, this is terrible, terrible, terrible. And I heard it's about to go around the school, but it sounds like other students are about to do the right thing. I think they're going to report it to principals or administration staff or counseling or the police or somebody. Um, and the community, uh, I heard it's going to stop. Investigators are about to get involved. There's about to be a huge investigation with this. It's about to get shut down. Um, and I heard somebody will end up in prison over this. So I don't know if the parent or parents are going to end up in prison over this. Maybe the Aries is a parent of this uh, teenager. Maybe there's somehow the Aries is involved with this, with all these phone calls. So whoever this Aries is, whoever you are, Aries, if you resonate with this, somehow the Aries is involved with this. Um, so I, I feel in one situation, the Aries might be the parent of this teenager. Um, or they might be an investigator. Or they might be involved with, there's a lot of investigations in here. They might be involved with the investigation of the business of the Aquarius or the Taurus or what have you, what have you. There's a lot going on in here. So you just plug it in how it resonates, okay? But this is going to be shut down and somebody will end up in prison, whether it's a parent of, one of this teenager, the teenager possibly, or the person that helped the teenager distribute the porn video um or what have you what have you i'm not sure okay but i will tell you this teenager that's doing this one they want to do it it's not pre uh it is premeditated but they free willingly made the choice to do it nobody was it revenge porn nobody was um holding you know holding them hostage or what have you what have you they wanted to do it i will tell you that um for the money Revenge porn is different. You're not making money off of it. Um, somebody's doing it out of revenge towards you. And you don't make a damn dime. This person made a lot of money off of it. Um, but they are definitely a minor. And and the parent, one of the parents of this teenager is that Libra. And that person is not correct. 
I mean, one they help somebody steal somebody's money and a large amount of money of that, and they were obsessed and stalked and creeped this same person they stole from. So that's not mentally correct all around the board, and that's just the truth. And their it sounds like their daughter is a little wannabe porn star, and that's about to backfire. That's crazy. I'm just being for real. If my daughter did something like that, I would go bananas. I mean, not like in a, have to call the police on me bananas. But that's not cool. That is not cool. My kids know that's not cool. And that's just the truth. When this teenager gets questioned, they're going to try to play victim. They're going to bring up a rape of the past. Air sign energy. It's about to be very detrimental for the person, the rape person in the past. They are a pedophile and they are an adult. Oh my God, this is so messy. This is so messy. This is so messy. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard when this person... When this starts getting investigated, it's out It's out right now, like the porn video, it sounds like. And it's about to get out more. Hadn't got shut down yet. Um, some of this, it sounds like, happened, has happened. Some has not with this. This is a hotness express. But anyways, I heard once it gets shut down, um, um, uh, oh, God, I'm sorry. It's just, just so much going on in this. Like, what? Who does this shit? Like, this is not a correct family. This this person needs a loving family that needs large to love your body, not exploit it, and make a lot of money off porn videos. And that's just the truth. Um, but anyways, I heard um, once this occurs, the um, teenager sounds like when they get questioned by the police or whoever or investigators or whoever they're about to get questioned by, heard they're going to try to play victim. Um, some kind of rape in the past. So I don't know if they got raped in the past or somebody else got raped in the past. But somebody got raped in the past. I think it might have been them that got raped in the past, possibly. Um, there's a reason they're going to bring up... I heard they're going to try to play victim mentality. So I think they might have got raped in the past. And they, they're going to try to pawn that off as a reason why they love to have sex, possibly. Possibly. I didn't hear that. That's just my deductive logic and reasoning. But how that resonates... Somebody got raped in the past, whether it was them or somebody else, and they're going to try to smooth that off onto investigators. The investigators are going to see right through it, right through it. Okay, I heard they're going to see right through it. They're going to see right through it. Well, thank God, um, because it sounds like they're about to, t uh, it's about to be victim mentality, man. Victim mentality. Oh, well, I got raped in the past, which nobody should be raped in the past. I just want to disclaim with that. Nobody should be raped in the, uh, should be raped. Nobody should, but you shouldn't use if this person did get raped in the past, they should not use that as a footstool and a pedestal to promote making money as a minor off porn videos because that's illegal. That is illegal and it's against federal law to my knowledge. But they want to try to manipulate the system because they were raped in the past. Well, that's not, I mean, you can't do that. And that's just the truth. The rules are the rules for a reason. If this teenager watches, which you're not supposed to watch, you're supposed to be 18 plus watch. Just saying, just saying. But anyways, um, so, yeah, so, um, I heard, um, uh, they're about to get involved. They're about to get involved, and, um, this part, the teenager's gonna try to play victim, somebody about a rape in the past. Uh, I heard an air sign pedophile. So I think a Gemini Libra Aquarius might have raped this teenager or raped somebody else. But somehow, a rape of the past and an air sign is significant. A Gemini Libra Aquarius. Pedophile. Um, and I heard it's not going to go well for this Gemini Libra Aquarius pedophile. So I think they might have raped this teenager and the teenager is going to use it like for victim mentality. Oh, please feel sorry for me. I was raped in the past, but now I want to make a lot of money and be a porn star. You know, that's kind of what I feel, but you plug it in how it resonates. I don't know. I'm not this person, but this is terrible. In this aspect, this is sexual instinct. Um, 
But they're you. It sounds like they're using the rape of the past, whether they were raped in the past or somebody else was raped in the past, as a pedestal to promote sexuality and um, promiscuous promiscuous. How do you say that? Promiscuous promiscuous behavior and porn distribution as a minor, which that's against federal laws. So sexual instincts. But they're about to get a huge wake up call. It's too much, man. Many shocking series shame events are about to occur with this situation soon. These people are about to ever regret the past, ever regret it. Many shocking series of chain events are about to occur with this situation soon. Um, they're about to ever regret the past. So you guys plug it in how it resonates. I love you guys so much. I hope this helped and I'm staying.